All right, this is John Kohler with DiscountJuicers.com and have the all new Omega Vert VRT 330 juicer that I'll be showing you today. I just got finished juicing some vegetables, and so I got done juicing uh, carrots, cucumbers, celery, spinach, and collard greens, and as you can see, the juicer inside is still all dirty. Now, this is my favorite feature of the Omega Vert juicer. It's literally self-cleaning. So let's check it out. All you do is I have you know the normal pictures over the side of the table. I put these spare ones right here to show you that are totally clean. And literally all you're gonna do is you're gonna take a pitcher of water, right? And you can see some residual pulp coming out of the machine. You're gonna take that pitcher of water and just pour it through the machine. Now you don't wanna pour it too quick and just pour it right through there. And what'll happen is there's an automatic cleaning system inside the machine, which is a silicone wiping blade, much like the windshield wipers on your car when you're driving in the rain. These wipers actually wipe the screen off to keep the screen clean, which means a higher yield and easier to use and easier to clean because as it's working, it's cleaning the screen. So your job at the end of the juicing session is gonna be a lot easier. So you can see as we're putting the water in, you can see the water is first coming out orange. And now if you put the water in long enough, the water will finally come out clear. So the water is now finally coming out clear. And now we're ready to juice our fruits. So now we're going to put in our regular juice catch, our pulp catch, and our juice catch. And then we have a clean juicer. So we didn't even have to stop to take it apart. And when I juice, I try to juice, you know, uh, mostly vegetables and then maybe I'll add in some apple or pears for sweetness if the, if the vegetable juice is too harsh. And then I like to juice my fruits separately. So right now we're going to make uh, cherry juice, grape juice, orange, and apple juice. Now I wouldn't necessarily recommend, you know, mixing all those together. Um, I think it's best to juice one fruit at a time. If you, if you want to mix them, you can, of course, but we're going to make them separate today to show you how it works. Now the most impressive thing to juice with the Omega, ju Omega Vert Juicer is the cherries. So these are cherries, we just literally only took off the stems and we only put them into the machine. And you'll hear that crack, that popping sound. I mean, what that is, that's literally the juicer exploding the cherry pit and juicing the cherry. So you can see out of the machine is coming cherry juice on one side. The other side, you're gonna get the cherry pulp. So the cherry pulp is the, the pulp of the fruit and also the ground up seed. So I wouldn't try this with any other juicer on the market. You're gonna damage your juicer. But with the Omega Verb Juicer, it's completely okay. But the other thing is you don't wanna just dump a lot of cherries in at the same time. You kinda of gotta like, you know, maybe put one at a time and feed them nice and slow. So I think that's all the cherry juice. Sometimes when I'm done juicing, I like to just tip the juicer a little bit and that'll help the rest of the juice that's inside the juicer to come out. Maybe shake it a little bit, because otherwise you'll pull the juice uh, catch bin away and then it'll drip some more and you'll lose some valuable cherry juice. And you know, I don't know about you, but cherries are really expensive. This makes nice, literally thick and creamy cherry juice. The next thing we're gonna juice here are some grapes. So with the grapes, you're gonna literally take the, the stems and all and you know, just drop the grapes in there. I like to usually just peel the grapes off because that, that slows you down because once again you don't want to overload the juicer and as fast as you could take the grapes off the stems, you could feed them in and that's going to make you a nice grape juice. And so grape juice is really good for us. We've all remember, you know, uh, off the store, you know, I'm not saying any brand names of grape juice, but you know, fresh grape juice tastes really amazing. And if you can, try to get wine grapes to juice. Now, unless you live in somewhere where they grow wine grapes, it might be kind of hard, so you're going to end up with these kind of grapes. But even better, you want to juice grapes with the seeds. So even if you can't get the wine grapes with the seeds, because wine grapes are sweeter, because they have a higher sugar content, because the sugar is meant to ferment into the wine. So if you're juicing them, it's just going to taste that much sweeter. Actually, Concord grapes are my favorite grapes to, to um, juice, actually. It tastes so good. But you want to juice the grapes with the seeds. I mean, you could go to the health food store and buy uh, basically a supplement or a grape seed extract supplement, and that's really high in antioxidants. So when you take the grape seeds, put them through the Omega Vert juicer, it juices the grapes and the crushes the seeds and gets some of the nutrition out of the seeds into the juice that you'll be drinking. So it's a lot more better for you. So you can see here, I mean, it's having no problems with grapes. 
as fast as I could put them in, it's, it's only juicing it. And I mean, we didn't even juice that many grapes and look at all that grape juice it's making. And look at that, hardly any grape pulp has come out. That's because grapes are, you know, have a really high water content. And the vert is so efficient at taking out the juice out of the grapes. So we'll go ahead and finish up those grapes there. And we're gonna move on to the next thing. So as you can see here, this pulp, this pulp is literally bone dry. I mean, the only other way to get dry pulp is this, is to use like a grape press. That's what, you know, uh, wine growers use. I mean, this stuff is so dry, I can press it and there's no juice left in it. It's totally amazing. No other juicer is gonna get pulp this dry when you're juicing grapes. So we're, once again, I like to tip the juicer up a little bit, get the juice out. I'm gonna go ahead and put all this grape juice in a glass. Next thing we're gonna do, we're gonna go ahead and juice some oranges. So I have some oranges here. I also like to juice things like tangerines. And now the one thing I wanna tell you about when, before you juice oranges is that when you juice oranges, you can't just cut up the orange and put them in whole. It's true that you know most fruits, you can actually just cut and put the skin in at all, but you know oranges is not one of them. I mean, you could even put the skin in of pineapple, not that I'd recommend it, because they do spray you know, the skin with things unless it's an organic pineapple. But even things like cantaloupe, you could put cantaloupe skin into the verb juicer, it'll juice it just fine. Watermelon rinds, great, put them right in. It'll make your juice actually a little bit more mild because the rind has a lot of the chlorophyll content and actually make your juice a lot healthier. But with the oranges, we don't want to be juicing the skin because there's some chemicals in the skin that's actually non-digestible from us and it'll give you bad gas and bloating. So don't do it. But what you do want to do is that you do want to peel your oranges. So whether you use like a carrot peeler to peel it, or actually I just used a knife, you do want to leave on the white pith. I mean, you could just peel it with your hand and, and segment it out and do that, but I like to leave on the white pith because this will make an orange juice like no other. And this is going to be the best orange juice you've ever had. It makes it nice, creamy, and frothy. And so most of the time when you go to the store and you know you get orange juice in the carton, they're just literally taking the orange, cutting it in half, and giving you, selling you the orange water. So you're actually missing out on a lot of the nutrition that you could be getting if you had the Omega Verb Juicer. You could get the white pith, and as we know, the white pith is the most nutritious part of the orange. So it's going to also mild out the juice, too. It's not going to be taste quite as sweet because the pith will balance out the sugar, the sweetness, with you know, the, the kind of a little bit tartness of the pith, but you're going to get a lot more nutrition. The bioflavonoids are mostly in the white pith. So if you make orange juice every day, you want to make orange juice with that white pith. We're gonna push that in. As you can see, we just juiced pretty much two oranges, and we got um, you know almost two cups of juice. And the pulp, the pulp's you know fairly dry. I mean, I can press it out, and I'm I'm just squeezing orange pulp in my hand, and there's no juice, really residual juice that's left. So once again, you know the vert is one of the most efficient juicers to juice fresh fruits. So we're gonna go ahead and you know pour this out a little bit. Not much orange juice left in there. We're gonna take our glass. So the last thing we're gonna juice right now is apples. So I like to add apples actually into my vegetable juices. And once again, juicing apples in the Omega Vert is no problem. You just, you know, put the apples in. It's really self-feeding. It does a really good job when you're juicing apples. Now for best juicing, you know, you wanna get hard and firm apples. You don't wanna pick apples at the store that are all soft and, and mealy. Because once the apple goes soft on you, then it's going to make more of a mush and it's not going to juice as good for you. So when I go to the store to pick apples to juice, I, I try to get nice and firm ones that, that don't really yield to any pressure. So as you can see, we're, we literally just juiced uh, two apples just in this short amount of time. And we have a little bit more than one cup of juice. And we're going to pour out this apple juice. So the juices that you will make in the Omega Verb Juicer are going to be a lot higher quality than other juicers on the market because of the low speed, low 80 RPMs, it tends to not oxidize the food as much, and also you're gonna get a higher yield. So even though the vert does cost a little more than some of the other juicers on the market, you know, you're gonna save money in the long run because when you, you know, buy cherries at $5 a pound and you juice them and you get really dry pulp, you're extracting most all the juice from those, from that five pounds of cherries that you bought. Now if you use another juicer, and you maybe only get 50% of the juice out, you're literally throwing money down the drain in wasted produce unless you do something with the pulp. 
So because the Omega Vert juicer yields more, you're gonna save money in the long run. The Omega Vert juicer does have a 10 year warranty. So should the juicer you know, fail in 10 years, uh, it's gonna be covered by warranty. So you know, I like to think of it as a juicer as an investment. And it's an investment in the most important thing in your life. It's an investment in your health. I mean, if you don't have your health, you don't have anything. At a young age, I almost lost my health. I was in the hospital, the doctors told me I, not, I might not make it out alive. So at that point, I really got serious about changing my lifestyle and to become a lot healthier. So with the Omega Vert Juicer, it's the most important investment you could make and it's backed up with a 10 year warranty. And also it's easy to use. So I, wanna, I want you to buy a juicer that you will use every day, not just say, oh, I have a juicer, but you know, I barely use it because it's a pain to clean. And I've heard that about a lot of juicers, but I could definitely say the Omega Vert Juicer is one of the easiest juicers to clean. So this is John Kohler with discountjuicers.com. Be sure to visit discountjuicers.com YouTube for special promotional offers for our YouTube visitors.